So now we're ready to go ahead and let's start to give her some of this botulinum toxin here as we go. So we've already drawn all of this up. So let's focus in on the forehead because that's where we're going to go first. And you're going to feel a couple of quick little pinches here, okay? And we're just going to go right next to these marks and just want to check with the cameraman. Are we good to go? Okay, terrific. And what we're going to do, we're giving her, um, I'm just going to give you ranges because every patient is different. I want to make sure that you are not going to be a cookbook injector here. We're going to give her anywhere from 10 to 12 units of Botox on this one right here. And we just want to spread it out. And that's exactly what we want to do. Turn towards me there just a little bit. And we are using Comfort Tox needles. These are the most comfortable needles on the market. And they are just fantastic. They are 31 gauge. And we use a lot of, lot of different syringes uh, for, this, for these patients because we want a brand new needle uh, there. And uh, we want a brand new needle tip for every one of these injections here. And we have spread this botulinum toxin nicely across. And you can see a tiny bit of bleeding here and there. People are gonna get all kinds of, you know, you're getting a lot of injections. So there's no question that uh, you will get a little bit of bleeding here and there. But, you know, I'd like to try to avoid, you know, bruising as much as possible. And uh, usually if you're gonna get a bruise, you will see it right away. I don't anticipate anything in the area that I just treated right there. And when you're injecting the frontalis muscle, which is a very thin muscle, um, you're gonna go right underneath the skin. You'll pretty much be into the muscle. If you do go ahead and hit bone and hit the skull there, that's the skull is a very good landmark, okay? Do not go through the skull, which you won't be able to, but you never want your injection to be pressing against any kind of bone, whether that's outside, you know, anywhere on the face, whether it's inside the mouth, if you're a dentist, and we know those injections there too, because then you're underneath the periosteum. And that's typically a more painful injection. And we want to be known as the most, uh, the most comfortable injectors. And that is with technique. And that's using the right uh, syringes. And that's where the Comfortox syringes by StatDDS really come in. Let's go ahead and give her in this glabellar complex. And again, I'm going to give you the range is anywhere from 10 to 20 units of botulinum toxin. So you're going to feel a little pinch right here. And she's a newbie to this. She has, uh, this is the first time she's getting this and you are a terrific patient there, Lynn. So we really do appreciate that. You're doing just great little pinches here and there. And we're gonna give her a little bit more right here. I'm holding this very strategically because I'm kind of, I wanna make sure that no botulinum toxins are gonna get down to these eyelid muscles. And we don't want her to touch her face because I don't want her to move it around. And I'm kind of sealing this off as I give this injection right here. Gonna feel a pinch. And this is the last one for this. And you did just great. Okay, terrific. I'm also trying to move my hand so that you folks at home can go ahead and see this. Let me clean her up. As you clean her up, okay, and just you're always going to wipe everything up and away from the eyes. And everybody that's trained in the AAFE, this is literally something that we imprint on their brain up and away from the eyes always. And that's exactly what we're looking for. We don't want to move anything towards the eyes there. So she is doing just great. Ready for more, Lynn? Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah, she's, she is ready. And, and I've told her already. She is absolutely going to love the result. And, you know, it's always great to get someone on the first time because when they see the result in a few days when this kicks in, um, it's really something special here. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to turn you a little bit more that way. Is that good? Can you see that? Okay, terrific. And here we're gonna go. This is gonna be directed away from the eye. Make sure I turn this so I can see how much I'm giving here. Here, I, you know, the general rule can be anywhere from four to, to 10 to 12 units of botulinum toxin if you're using uh, if you're using uh, Botox or Dysport because that is pretty much the same. And you can go ahead and use that right there. That is great. How you doing, Lynn? All right. Okay, so far so good. Now let's go ahead and do the other side here. And again, same range. Uh, she's going to be in the upper range of 4 to 12 units of botulinum toxin here. And you can see, we're giving her some there. And we're always, we always want to be away from the eyes here. And that's exactly what you're doing great, Lynn. 
and you can see all this, the delivery of this does not take very long. And again, this will take about two to 10 days to kick in. And again, I wanna make sure that we're going to push this in the right direction. And again, you don't see anything in terms of bleeding or bruising. And usually if you're gonna get a bruise, especially in this area where there's a lot of venous complex, um, so it's very easy to get a bruise. If you get a bruise, you get a bruise. I mean, that's okay. But usually you're gonna see something right away and I don't see anything on her uh, right now. So we're really not anticipating much that's going to be going on there. Now, uh, master injections. These will be real, real quick. Turn towards me a little bit. And there's my spot. Bite your teeth together again for me. I like to always still grab it so I know exa exactly where I'm at. Master injections as fast as you can give it is still not fast enough. So you're just gonna lay it in there so you can go ahead and give it. We're gonna turn this way. And all my syringes are ready. So it's all pulled up and this is the way it should be in every office. Now this side is the bigger side so it's gonna get a little bit more. Bite your teeth together again for me so I can feel that. I'm gonna go right next to this. And again, fast as you can give it, just Get it in there and get it into that muscle and you are pretty much done with the botulinum toxin injections. How was that, Lynn? Fine. Yeah, you did great. You're really a great patient. And like I said, uh, let's make sure, don't touch your face. And if you're gonna put on makeup, very light makeup, try to use kind of newer makeup um, because some of the old makeup has got just a lot of stuff in it. Um, that we don't want to put into fresh injection sites. And that's it for botulinum toxins. So you did great and we'll get you back and we'll get after pictures and we'll see how you did.